ng uh, andido din sa Santa Cruz Marindo kay ay 60.45 per liter para makita nyo yan magandang magandang araw mga katatay at welcome back din sa ating channel sa nga pala ngayong araw na ito ay may pupuntahan tayo at samahan nyo kami dahil pupunta kami sa Luzon Datum of 1911 only here in Marinduque matatagpuan nyo ang pinakasentro ng Pilipinas tara let's go so yun mga katatay mula buyabot Santa Cruz Marinduque pupunta tayo ng Luzon Datum which is nasa sakupan ng Mugpog Marinduque ito ay may layong uh, 45.6 kilometers at uh, sa tingin ko ay eh, abutin kami ng isang oras at kalahate sa biyahe So yun mga katotay, nandito na tayo ngayon sa may, uh, may kukumpara ko na mas uh, paboritong likuan dyan sa Maridake which is yung Big C. Uh, dito sa Marindu yung magsasawa kayo ng mga pakurba-kurba kasi marami dito yung palikulik ng daan. Ayun mga katotay, mga lipas ang isang oras. Uh, eto na yung daan patung na Luzon Datum and uh, may gulat kami kasi napakaganda pa rin ang kasada dito cementado and uh, basta sobrang ganda ng aura niya kasi grabe yung mga view dito sa dadaan niya Son datos. Ahora 
Ayan mga katatay, napakatarik po pala. <laughs> Grabe. Okay, pag umakit tayo dito sa Luzon Datong po, ano? kailangan natin mag-vlog muna at si Madam yung bantay. <laughs> station of the cross po ito, pataas na. Mm -hmm. Station of the cross yan. 14 stations of the cross ang may encounter mo sa pag-akyat ng Luzon Datong mga katatay. Kaya naman napakagandang isama nito sa bakit di sa darating na Holy Week ngayong 2022. Kaya may tubig. Ayan, may timbang. Ipan po isa. The Luzon Datum of 1911 was the base for the first modern survey in the Philippine Islands. The execution of triangulation of the Philippine Islands extended over almost as a long time as the history of the American occupation in the Philippines. The plan of the government to survey the islands began in March 1900 when the United States Coast and Geodetic Survey or USCGS officer was sent to Manila with instruction to prepare a report on the existing cartographic conditions in the Philippines and to obtain all information necessary for the execution of geodetic, hydrographic, and topographic surveys in the country. After the establishment of sub office known as Manila Field Station, which was housed in the old Intendencia building in the walled city of Intramuros, the USCGS commenced fieldwork in the Philippine Islands in January 1901. At that time, an insurrection was in progress in the islands under military law. The field surveys were conducted under a joint agreement between the USCGS and the insular government. From 1901 to 1911, the USCGS established several triangulation network across the country which had different origins. In 1911, these different networks on different datums and with different origins were consolidated into one nationwide network and the Luzon Datum was established with triangulation station Palanacan as its datum origin. The Luzon Datum became the primary geodetic reference of all surveys in the Philippines. The Luzon Datum of 1911 site is not only for map makers, enthusiasts, or surveyors. The local government made the hike to the summit easier with the newly constructed 468 stair steps up to the summit. There are covered rest areas at many points during the climb. There is also a narrow paved 
road close to completion so other visitors who can climb the stairs like elderlies or PWDs can also appreciate the beauty at the summit too. A statue of Virgin Mary and a higher octagonal platform to overlook the marker that looks like giant compass is installed at the top. Make sure to stay for the sunset or climb before sunrise to enjoy the views, scenic ridges, and mountain slopes leading to the sea. An iconic stone marker with a hole 6 cm deep and 1.5 cm in diameter. There were several arguments that the central reference point of the country should have been in Romblon, but up to now, the National Mapping and Resource Information Agency Namrea, the country's central mapping agency still considers the station Balnacan as the reference point for all surveys and mapping activities in the Philippines. So yun mga katatay, kung gusto mong mapuntahan ito nga yung sundato mo, ito yung nilatawag na pinakasentro ng Pilipinas na matatagkuhan namang dito sa Marinduque. Ay, isama nyo na po ito sa bucket list nyo sa darating na Holy Week. Total, itong Luzon Datum naman po ay merong Station of the Cross. So, magandang magandang puntahan din po siya. And, bilang isang Pilipino, uh, nararapat lamang na mapuntahan ito ng bawat isa. Sapagkat, ito ang bubuo sa pagka-Pilipino mo.